buildings have been rebuilt, the churches have been rebuilt or construction is going on, memorials have been built for people who have been killed in the churches, uh, then injured people have been treated uh, and some of them have got uh, compensation already. Uh, so in that sense, you no, know, some have, things have been done, but of course they still remain traumatized. I think the, the survivors and the family members, and I think a lot will have to be done to address their trauma and people who have been physically injured. I think a lot will have to be done to rebuild their lives. There were more than 60 families affected at Kochikai. 54 deceased brothers and sisters. 106 injured. 4 disabled. 70 major injuries. Let us continue to pray. Let us accompany them in their life journey. Let us show to the world that we are Catholic followers of Christ. Uh, people are still at a state of shock and they are you know, still unable to kind of reconcile themselves with what has happened. That memory is, I think, still haunting them a lot. People are still in, you know, hospital. For them to get to know that, you know, their child is dead or their husband or wives are dead, then no more. It's a, a terrible pain and trauma. There are some pieces like other bodies pieces blasting time. I thought from it is uh, but it's not is fine, only bleeding from the ears. After that I searched the baby, she was injecting on the stomach and say stomach also outside. Then we get to the hospital. Then after that she goes done three operations they are you know anxious they are you know they have uh, panic attacks some of them and uh, in the beginning it was worse now thanks to all of these professional counselors you know they're healing psychosocial support i would say it's it's is the most needed thing uh, including uh, to the priests and uh, pastors uh, as well because they are also at a state of shock and they are unable to recover uh, well, from that uh, mindset. This happened to a particular religious community and the way they look at the whole thing may differ from the normal psychosocial support uh, that you know uh, that would come from a professional, uh, you know, stream. So there is uh, that, you know, uh, kind of gap which, you know, where we find it a bit difficult to bridge. We as an evangelical alliance now trying to um, build a, a group of uh, Christian counselors because that's one of the greatest needs that we have come to realization. It will take some time for them to reconcile with the past and then, you know, uh, 